yes. Mm -hmm. uh, this resistance, yeah. Mm -hmm. There, there, clearly, there's a strong resistance existing to enacting perfect, uh, protections that would encompass all abused people. Yes. I have often mentioned that the Violence Against Women's Act, yes, and the stop grants that are there to, well, make the literature, yes. Why don't you give me the stop grants in every state of the United States and then those that are legally liable for the spending of that money? Yeah. Now, I thought it should be the Violence Against Women and Men's Act, the VAWMA. <laughs> Now, uh, this resistance on the part of law uh, lawmakers yeah, forces myself as a man to carry a larger burden, improving uh -huh, my right to the protection and the defenses against a wife that has abducted my sons for seven and a half years. Battered heterosexual men as a legitimate group. Oh. Now, this Violence Against Women's Act, yeah, uh-huh. Significant legitimacy to the plight of battered women at the national level. Ooh. But somebody thought that women could not be violent. Yes. That my wife didn't hit me on Guam. Yes. I just want to know the women stop grant. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, all of those that received any of that money. Po 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 Did you know in 1996 men constituted almost one third of the deaths caused by intimate partners? Yes. That's as if women, yeah, when they go off the handle, when they completely lose it, mm -hmm, they decide to kill their spouse. <laughs> Where I never committed any domestic violence. <laughs> now, another Department of Justice study indicates men are victims of domestic violence 39% of the time. Oh, <laughs> let's say your wife made up a story and had you put in jail for 10 days on Guam. Yes, abducted your sons, moved to Clallam County, and they issued a protection order. And since then, until now, every sheriff and cop right now. Now, the Washington Domestic Violence Judges Manual, mm, I gave you a copy of that, all 850 fucking pages of it. Mm. Domestic violence, women, blatant disregard for a large number of abused persons. Yes. I'm a heterosexual man that you thought, well, I should just take it like a man. Now, this reporting of the abuse that I've done in all those emails. Yes. I reported abuse today. Pooch. I reported the abuse of making me go to court when you have the evidence I didn't commit a crime. Societal pressure that I should take it like a man. Mm -hmm. I shouldn't demand that my civil rights get enforced. Yes. Demand custody of my sons. Pooch. I should not tell you to enforce the fucking laws of the United States of America. Now, losing the custody of my sons when my wife did not give me notice of court hearings, Judge Rora Pooch had no proof of service. Yes, where well, you gave her everything she asked for because you refused to acknowledge my rights as a man. It can be societal, social suicide for a man to come forward and admit his wife's abuses of him. <clears throat> Why do I feel like I'm suicidal? Yes, because every time I send you an email, you decide you're con Ironically, if a man does call for help, he's often the one arrested. <laughs> Look at that, November 20th of 2015. I emailed all three police departments. Yes, and I was the one that got arrested for a crime I didn't commit. Pooch, I email you every day since you arrested me. <clears throat> I'm in a no-win situation. Pooch, pooch. But I thought there was a big sign here, right here. Yes, as in, I'm going to sue every cop right now, do you understand? Because you're fucking bullshit about being delusional for not realizing that my rights are being violated. Oh. Oh. Yeah, not using the telephone, but sending you an email mm -hmm, documenting crime and that I'm suicidal because of the no-win situation that you never enforce the rights of a man because of your... Gender bias against American men. It is clear that some women have the potential to be violent. Uh -huh. Initial. Uh -huh. After the last seven and a half years of my wife keeping me son my sons in the wrong grade. Yes. Did she ever get angry at him? Pooch. Because as I read here, yeah. Uh, there's a possibility uh -huh, that my sons will be aggressive. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Now, uh, a bias survey gives very little credibility to the notion that women only use violence in self-defense. Yes. 
how many women have been convicted of the crime of child abduction? Now, uh, the woman chasing after a man with a rolling pin, mm -hmm. women are more likely to abuse or even kill their children. I think it's abusive to deprive me of my rights as a father because you want to keep my sons in the wrong grade because you can't admit the laws of the United States. If women's group want to acknowledge the progress women have made, then they mu also must advocate taking responsibility. Mm. Sheriff, could you take responsibility today? taking responsibility mm -hmm. for one's actions rather than denying that women abuse men mm -hmm. and hiding behind the image they are trying so hard to obliterate. Oh, mm -hmm. now I'm going to want my sons today. Do you understand? Yeah. And I'm going to want to know all of those that receive funding for services Training officers and prosecutors. Yes, money is earmarked for stopping violence against women, according to the formula grant in the VAWA. Mm -hmm. Washington is one of the states that has received stop money, mm -hmm. uh, specifically for battered women and children. There's no money for heterosexual men. <coughs> Admitting that men are a victimized group who gravely endanger their funding. Ouch. As in, all this money goes to the victims known as women. Ouch. Because you don't enforce the rights of men. <laughs> Try to obtain information may not receive fair. Ouch. A little lawsuit right there. Ouch. Now, the effect of providing money to agencies with a tag of helping stop violence against women precludes it from being used for men. <laughs> every time I told you I wanted the victim's resources, every time I told you that I wanted to stay in a hotel, sleep in a bed, and bathe in a bathtub, how the fuck is it that you thought that I, as a heterosexual man, don't have the same rights as a woman? I'm going to want some of that money. Uh-huh. Now, uh, the King County Coalition Against Domestic Violence provides the warning that thousands of women are battered a year mm -hmm. and that the men who batter them go to jail and lose everything. Oh, look it, I've been to jail multiple times. Pooch. One time I was found not guilty and I lost everything. Oh, then I went to jail again for a crime I didn't commit in Squim, Washington. Lost some more. Pooch. Then I went to jail again for failure to appear when I wasn't in Brenner, Washington, and I lost some fucking more. Mm -hmm. Even allow large male children. See, some shelters uh -huh, uh -huh, uh, will not allow my large male sons that play football on the Quilcene football team yes, to seek refuge at a shelter because they may frighten the other people. <laughs> may pick some of their father's aggressive tendencies. <clears throat> now, do you think that I'm an intense, aggressive man <clears throat> that could have influenced the genetics yes, of a football team that has my sons playing on it yes, that are two grades behind where they should be in the United States of America? Thank <laughs> you.